The Deputy Senate President and Governorship Candidate of All Progressive Congress APC in Delta State, Senator Ovio Moagege, says the Delta State government, led by Dr. Ifayo Kowa, has misappropriated the sum of 2.8 trillion naira of the state fund in seven years on failed projects across the 25 local government areas of the state. Ovio Moagege, who made this known while addressing newsmen at the campaign council office in Asaba, the state capital, identified the recent collapse building of the multi-sports complex at the Stephen Cash Stadium in Asaba as one amongst the failed projects of the governor. Okuma's government alone has swallowed up well over 2.8 trillion naira in seven years. We are all Deltans here. See anything on ground that is commensurate with the receipt of this 2.8 trillion naira. The PTP government has abandoned the riverine areas of the state to their own devices. When compared to other states in Niger Delta, with similar FARC and IGL, Delta State is beset by poor or non-existent infrastructure. The net effect is that the state looks like a giant junkyard. Most of the rules and structures reportedly executed by the poor government in the last seven years have failed, and in many instances, actually collapsed. Many such field projects that litter the state are being recycled and we are going to produce without a visionary and credible plan for sustainable infrastructural development. Recent examples include the back-to-back -back collapse and fire in sections of the state of the state of Asaba. However, Senator Ovio Magege noted that the state is not where it ought to be under the control of the PDP in the past seven years. In history, have we faced such difficult times in our dear state? Beyond politics and political party affiliation, we all know that with the enormous resources and competence of Deltans all over the world, our state is not where it ought to be. Under the PDP, and especially in the last seven years, the problems of Delta State have been squarely rooted in bad leadership, misplaced priorities, pervasive incompetence, and even corruption. The offer of PDP in the 2023 gubernatorial elections in the person of the right honorable Sherry Francis Oboroguri is a bad one for Delta State. Right incompetence, bad judgment, and everything that went wrong in the past seven years. Delta State deserves better. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.